Hey, hello everybody. Welcome to the Sound Test Room. Today we are taking a look at a, a brand new app called Wider from Polyverse here and Infected Mushroom. And it's an AUV3 stereo expander. Uh, we'll have a look at the App Store description in just a sec. It is 100% free. Uh, so I'll sh let's have a look at the App Store description before we go any further. And then you can uh, we can have a quick look at what's here. It is... Wider, which is free stereo expander. Wider is a mono to stereo converter and stereo image widener plugin, AUV3 by Infected Mushroom and Polybase. It is a mono compatible and does not color the sound. So that's great. That means we can spread the load, if you like, stereo wise with mono or stereo things. And this is what we shall do. Now, the cool thing is with Wider is if we look at it here, this is on my mic channel, which we shall look at first. Um, you can go all the way from zero to 100%, which is here. So let's try that. So hello, one, two, one, two, one, two. That's 100% Wider. But yes, we can go even further. We can go all the way up to 200% giving you incredibly width and wide stereo imaging. Now, I would suggest you wear headphones or are listening through incredibly good monitors, well-placed, because you will get incredibly wide uh, staging with this app for free, for free. Hello. So we're going to go and do this through uh, various things. I have uh, a couple of, like rhythmic thing set up with a, a, a three noirs here and uh, a noir to boost the bass and then a widener, a widener. And then on this particular widener here at the moment, I have this LFO here changing how this widener works. So when this is on, this will go from off to on, off to on, because I've got the LFO set up with a square wave there and I've got the uh, widener effect Rooted to CC13, the like that. But you'll hear that as soon as it comes in, you'll hear it. And then we've also got it uh, to test on a Synthmaster one here, which is doing a sound called Big Key Synth. And we're going to apply to that. So I want you to hear how it sounds with pad sounds to spread them as well. And then we're going to try it with guitar as well, which sounds incredible. So we're going to have massive ambience. Guitar. We've got an FAC chorus here. We've got an eventide black hole. And then we have a widener at the bottom of that chain. And then here we just have a, a basic piano sound. Which we shall also widen as well. So you've heard it on voice. Let's hear it on the sort of the rhythmic stuff. So I'll start this little pattern off just by pressing play. And then I will slowly drop in the effects. So we'll drop in Nor first. And then we'll drop in this um, audio damage rat shack delay. And then we have this Nor doing like a kick drum sound. We shall put the wider on that now. Now that's awesome, right? So put some headphones on. Note it's switching on and off with the LFO. Up. 
hats. So you can see what the kind of cool effect you can get by putting it onto the rhythmic stuff as well. And then even hooking it up to the LFO. Let's see if I can just uh, move my mic volume up a little bit there so you can hear me a little bit better. So hooking it up to the LFO, you can create all sorts of cool movements. And hooking up to LFOs is pretty easy in AUM. You just go to MIDI control here. And then you find the track that you want to assign. And then you just choose like... You can go the. I mean, there's own for wider here. There is only one parameter, and that's the amount, which is nice. Okay, so let's move on a bit now, and let's hear it on this. Uh, let's turn the piano down, and let's turn this up. So there's no widening on that yet, and it's a lovely sound anyway. So let's slowly add some widening there. That play chord. Now you're making this pad sound massive. Makes it makes a huge, huge difference. Okay, so let's take it off the uh, let's turn the volume down for that. And so this is just the piano sound. <clears throat> so let's listen to this. Let's widen this a little bit while we're playing it. Very nice. So what I also did with this particular sound is I rooted Widener to the second channel. So I'm going to start this off and I'll show you. So what I did is root this LFO to the piano one as well, but you can see it's not moving at the moment. But I set it to, to 15, so if I switch it back to 15 now. But I left this one on a sign, like that. And it's not tempo synced, so we can just slow the rate down sort of thing, like this. And if we go back now and have a look at our piano one, now you can see it's moving really slowly. So if I play the piano now, we should we get some that nice chorusing effect as it gets wider and wider. Very 
very nice. It's amazing for free, this. Right, okay, so. And that's hooking it up to the LFO so we can stop the transport ball. And for the last part, we're going to have a look at the guitar. So the guitar, I'll, what I shall do is I will take the microphone out. And the first part of the guitar pit you'll hear will be the actual, just the dry guitar sound. The Bruce Free is there to prevent the... You can't really hear it. But, oh, you will if I turn this up, but... The Bruce Free is there to kill the amp noise. Uh, so I'll I'll mute the microphone and we shall uh, do the guitar. Hang on a sec. No, that's solo in it, dog, you idiot. <laughs> So there you go. There we have it. Wider, which is completely and utterly free by Polyverse and Infected Mushroom. So I shall put a link in the description below and you can rush off to the App Store and grab it for now and start making everything super spatial and wide. Marvellous, marvellous, marvellous tool for, in, for ambient music, you know, for widening massively reverbed guitars or effects and stuff like this. But the fact that you can kind of just put a mono or a stereo signal through it doesn't matter and it won't degrade it doesn't use phase cancellation or phasing or stuff like that i mean i don't know about the algorithms but it is lovely and it does it, it is a massive thing it is massively wide hugely wide all right guys thanks for watching if you like the video give it a thumbs up uh, subscribe to the channel um, please consider becoming a patron from as little as a dollar a month. Uh, help support what we do here at the Sound Test Room because we cannot survive without the help of the community. Or it, if all else fails, guys, and you, you don't want to do that and you could, can make a one-off donation, please do that if you can. We can carry on bringing you all the videos of all the cool new ops and things. Anyway, thank you very, very much. And uh, I shall see you guys later. Wider. Yes, yes. And it is much wider.